Hello, Boss Word. Welcome to Box and Block Center. First of all, I want to say good money to everyone around the globe, to the boxing fans who are subscribed to my channel, to the ones who are not subscribed to my channel, to the ones who want to subscribe to my channel, and to the ones who will subscribe to my channel. Good money to all of you guys. So, the news roaming around right now is that Lennox Lewis has stated that he does not believe Anthony Joshua, the unified king of the whole universe, is ready to fight Deontay Water or Tyson Fury next. He said that Water and uh, Joshua is using stalling tactics, you know. Joshua and his team don't want that work against either Water or Fury. And I want to really give my sincere thoughts on what I think about what the last undisputed king has stated. You know, how many times have I made a video, you know, about Lennox Lewis hating on Joshua? And a lot of people keep keep saying that well he isn't hating on Joshua. He just want to see the best fight the best. Yeah, I know, I know. I know which is cool. I mean, I wanna see the best fight the best. I mean I wanna see Joshua fight Water or Fury. I don't care about it. I just wanna see the fight because as a boxing fan, it is nice for us to see the best fight the best. And Joshua is the best right now. Okay? You might debate and say, well, Fury, well, Fury has no belt. And also, Joshua, he's the number one ranked heavyweight in the whole universe. In any rankings, go check it out. Joshua remains the number one. So let's just keep it real. <clears throat> uh, well, Alan Lewis has been very critical of Anthony Joshua since day one. I mean, when was the last time Lennox Lewis did an interview and gave Joshua props, at least <clears throat> for elevating the sport of boxing in the UK or taking it to the less, next level? Because if you look at the boxing atmosphere in the UK, the British fighters, the British fighters, used to travel to America to make a name for themselves. That's for real. That's that's just the truth. There is no doubt about that. There is no there is no argument. The British fighters, including Lennox Lewis himself, they all had to travel to America to make a name for themselves because British boxing industry wasn't that huge at that time. You know, it was good, it was it was big, but not huge. America was where everything is. And ever since Joshua came into the scene, he has been able to elevate the sport of boxing in the UK to the next level. And he did it under 22 fights, okay? The Klitschko and Joshua fight can never be forgotten. I mean, Lewis Lewis, looking at that event, I think Lewis Lewis got envious of Joshua. This guy is a... I mean, he just have to say it and just admit it. I hate Joshua. So people will just know who you are. You're a hater. I mean, I like Lewis Lewis. Okay, I like the guy. I mean, I, I'm, a, I'm a huge fan of Lewis Lewis. But everything that's been saying about Joshua is all coming out because he's a little bit jealous or envious of Joshua. That's just the truth. Lennox Lewis never got the love he wanted from the British fans during his prime. He never got it. Frank Bruno got more love than Lennox Lewis. Lennox Lewis was also envious of Bruno. Yeah, he was. 
Let's keep it real, guys. He was. You know, when Joshua won the Olympics, Olympic medal, a gold medal, I mean. So he is an Olympic, is an is an Olympic medalist. You know what I mean? So when he won the Olympic medal, which is gold, Elos Lewis was one of those guys to come out and say, "Well, I think uh, Joshua uh, got gifted the 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 medal. Uh, you know, the fight was very close, and uh, and Elos Lewis." Congratulated Joshua just to, you know, not look bad to the public. <laughs> just for him not to look bad to the public, you understand? That's why he did that. That's why he congratulated Anthony Joshua when Joshua became an Olympic medalist. Gold medalist, guys. So... Joshua has been trying to, you know, elevate the sport of boxing in the UK to the next level, which he successfully did and still doing. So we are going to give Joshua props for that. Joshua will fight any man, any day, anywhere. Jo and listen, listen, Joshua is an OG. Joshua is an OG. A lot of you guys don't know it. You see Joshua, you say, oh, he dress mad, you know, he talks well, he's very calm. Well, he is now uh, calm. Joshua is an OG, a real OG. A lot of you guys don't know, but I know it. Los stories should know that Joshua coming from where he came from, he should know that Joshua is a guy that fights anyone. I mean, he will fight anyone. He will fight Tyson Fury and Deontay Water on the same night. No problem. And he will knock both of them out cold. For Tyson Fury case, he's going to knock him out. If he doesn't knock Tyson Fury out, Tyson Fury wins on point. Tyson Fury is too good of a boxer. But you never know because Joshua can boast as well. He's just having shoulders. He's boasting all his boxing skills yet. So we're going to have to see more of it. I don't know what to say, guys. I mean, what do you guys think about this uh, comment coming from Little Slowers? Is it healthy to be a hater of someone? I don't think it is. And Lewis Lewis has achieved everything he ever wanted. You know, he became the undisputed everywhere king of the world. You know, he's still the last undisputed, okay? Still the last guy to all to to hold all the titles. Still the last guy to have had all the titles. Klitschko brothers, one of the Klitschko brothers could have been come the next one, but the Klitschko brothers would never fight each other. That's for sure. <laughs> they are brothers, so Vitaly Klitschko will not fight his younger brother Vladimir Klitschko. So they didn't fight each other so they never became on the spirit so I don't know I mean it's just um sad to to yell in us Lewis talk this way you know he's been telling Joshua to go to America and fight telling Joshua to go to America and fight fat water do that don't worry go there and yet we just saw what happened between Deontay Water and Tyson Fury. Judges robbed Tyson Fury of that win. Okay, let's keep it real, guys. I'm not trying to um, uh, be a fanboy of any fighter or trying to side with one, uh, side with uh, Water or side with Joshua. No, no, no. <clears throat> I'm just keeping it real. I'm just keeping it real. I'm a fan of Joshua, but I keep it real. You all know that, that that result is the fake result. It's a fake result, definitely, because Tassivir won that fight. Everybody knows that. Every 
boxing fan, real boxing fan knows that. I mean, even if you're just a cadre fan, you see someone, uh, you you would you definitely see what, what happened in that fight. I mean, Tessafiri um, got knocked down twice, definitely no doubt. But if you're going to score a fight, you score it round by round. So, after that robbery, how do you expect Joshua to go fight Deontay Water in Las Vegas? How does that make sense? That means Joshua is going to get robbed. So, that's why Joshua wants to fight Deontay Water first at Wembley Stadium and then go to America and fight him next. But good. So, what is wrong about that? What is wrong about the A side wanting to take control of the A side? I mean, how would the A side try to be the B side? Elos Lewis just don't want Joshua to do well. This guy is a hater of Joshua. So envious of Joshua. It is very sad to see this. As a boxing fan, it's sad. He's talking about Joshua ducking uh, water. During the, I think it was the final press conference. Or, yeah, final press conference. There was a press conference for all legends. You know, Riddick Bo was there. Lance Lewis was there. <clears throat> and Lance Lewis talked shit about Joshua. Saying that if I was offered a 50 million, I would have taken it. And listen, carefully, you listen. Joshua is a commercial powerhouse. You wasn't. You were a commercial powerhouse. You wasn't. That's why he didn't get that 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 such money. You know because Joshua is different. When will you guys understand it? Stop hating, Delos Lewis. I like you. I respect you. You're a great man. But stop hating on Joshua. Just stop being envious. You know Joshua will fight anyone, anytime, anywhere, any day. That's just the truth. So let's all keep it neutral. Because we just saw Deontay Water got at boss by Tessa Fury. And when he does fight Joshua, it's going to be even worse. Because Joshua, unlike Tessa Fury, has power. A devastating, monstrous power. That's it for now, guys. Give your thoughts below. Like the video, share, and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys.